There it is. We got him. Look at this. Dude. Today I want to show everyone how to catch a snake. Now this is the Florida black racer. This is the fastest species we have here in Florida. I'm going to do it all the while trying to not get bit. Right here y'all, under this leaf litter, I see a species. This is a venomous snake species. It is the Florida cottonmouth. He's, he's as at home here as he is in the water. Look at him y'all, what an incredible species. I may need another stick to lure him. There it is, we got him. Wow y'all, look at this. Oh my goodness. It's not every day that you run into a species like this. In this area though, I do know that they are pretty common. So, this is him. All right, this is the incredible Florida cottonmouth. Now, it's hard to believe how adorable a species like this is. And I can see a common misconception with this and the bald python as a juvenile. This cottonmouth, however, has a stunning bright yellow tail on it, and that can act as a lure and also a warning sign that, hey, I'm harmful or I'm venomous, don't mess with me. The diamond-shaped head also is an indication of a venomous snake here in Florida, and a lot of snakes have a somewhat uh, diamond-shaped head, but this really pronounced one is a dead giveaway that, hey, I'm venomous. Now, if you're trying to identify a cottonmouth as compared to a copperhead, you're going to want to look for the dark banding right up below the eyes. I'm going to go ahead and get this guy out of the bucket so we can better look at it. Alright, so right here, if you come here, look at that perfect camouflage. And this is the old uh, creek bed right here um, that flows very um, rapidly during any rainstorm. This is part of Florida's drain system. Now, this guy really wants to go back home in his natural environment right here. So I'm planning on letting him go now that we've got a lot of urban areas where he's going to be a threat. So once again, y'all, this is the Florida Cottonmouth. No, I will not take a bite from this, and no, I will not hold this. It's not worth my life, and it certainly isn't worth the views. Thank y'all so much for watching this episode. However, I'm your host, Alex, the Florida Wildlife Guy. We'll go ahead and let him go. There he goes. Let's see what he wants to do naturally. Truly incredible. Look at that excellent camouflage she has. Are you ready to take the Yeah. Alright, right here is a Florida cottonmouth. Now this is a very young juvenile cottonmouth. It is probably only a few months old. And a really interesting feature these baby cottonmouths have is that bright yellow tail. As you can see, that's a lure right there. And also a little bit of a warning as to beware, I'm dangerous, which is called. This is the smallest one I've ever seen. All right, right here we have the Florida Cottonmouth. Very small specimen. Get him striking, John. Put your camera real close. No, I'm just kidding. When you're looking at the camera and he moves, it's kind of scary, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> <laughs>